It all depends how I see my skin. I alternate products if my skin is dehydrated or if my skin needs a little bit more of acne care. Um, so today I really wanted to um, show you guys that your skin routine doesn't have to be all the time the same products. It could change. Um, remember your core products, which is your cleanser, your toner, and your moisturizer. And then you can add in your serums, your ampules, your acne treatment products, and um, your sheet masks. So today I see my skin that it's a little bit dry, so I need to, a little bit of hydration. I have some acne blemishes. And I've also seen, because it's so dry, um, I want to treat tonight my fine lines and underneath my eyes, plus my hyperpigmentation on both of my cheeks. So, let's begin. So I already washed my face. I did my double cleansing. So I started with my Hanskin um, BHA oil cleanser. Then I follow with my water-based cleanser. And the one that I use is the Quarks Low pH Good Morning Gel Cleanser. I focus on my areas that I have more of my acne. Take away my water-based cleanser with one of my pink sponges and I just let it air dry. Then I follow up with my toner and I'm using my favorite toner to treat my blemishes and is the Round Lab Mugwort Calming Toner. I've been exposed outside into the heat so I want to also calm down my acne and this is the perfect toner. It's vegan, it is so good, it doesn't have any fragrances actually. So I am going to use my multitaskers because I like to multitask on my wash off mask. So I'm gonna use it only on my blemishes. So I'm not gonna do it all over my face. And I'm using the Mamond Osuncho. I don't know how you say it in Korean, but Osuncho flower. And this is also good for sensitive skin. I'm just gonna leave it for, it says here to leave it 10 to 15 minutes. This brand actually focuses on using flowers on their formula. And while that goes, um, dries up, I am going to do a little bit of pore clearing too here. And I'm using my Innisfree color mask with volcanic clusters. Tend to use it more on my nose. So, to treat any blackheads, feel an acne coming up like right over here. And I just want to treat it before it bursts out and says hello. 12 minutes have passed by. I'm not gonna do 15, the whole 15 minutes. And I am going to take it off. Okay, now that I did my little treatment, I am going to do my essence and the one that I use is the Ulta Vitalizing Snail Essence Water. Snail is for repairing. I like to do double layers of essence because my skin is extra dry today. I just love this product so much. This is from Dewey Tree. Oh, I just love the smell. So good. Let it... Ooh, it absorbs so quick. Damn. Wow. My skin was very dry. <laughs> so I'm just gonna do more pump. Ooh, some pumps. So when I did my essence, I am going to do my other treatment of acne. Then again, like I told you guys, I see that my skin is pretty irritated. So I'm gonna use a sheet mask. And um, it's from Dr. Althea. And it's the Herb Therapy Velvet Mask has green tea, calendula, and chamomile. I love the texture of this sheet mask. I do highly recommend whoever is suffering from acne or dry skin or irritated skin. And on top of that, has sensitive skin. Definitely this sheet mask is so, so good 
for those types of skin concerns and skin types. Okay, so this one says to leave it 20 to 30 minutes. I'm gonna leave it for 30 minutes. I really want this sheet mask to do its magic. Um, I forgot to uh, mention that it will treat your acne, it will hydrate, and it will calm any irritation. Also, I forgot to mention the other ingredient that it has is ginger root, which is an antibacterial. So, best for people who are having acne. But you should definitely try the sheet mask. Although this is the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow PHA BHA um, toner, I use it as a spot treatment. Grab a little bit and just put it on, not all over my face. I just like it to my acne. If you don't know this product and you want to learn a little bit more and what does it have and everything i did a little product review one of my videos so check it out i'll post it right over here or here so like a little link coming out so you can check it out now that i have that i am going to do my glow recipe avocado melt retinol eye sleeping mask i love that so much i'm just gonna do it on my eyes it slightly I will be doing a review about this product so I'm not going to give it away too much but it's retinol and retinol is good for fine lines and wrinkles and also acne after that I use my beauty of Choson and it's the repair serum the ginseng and snail mason been using this for the past two months now and it's done so good for my hyperpigmentation. I'm just gonna put it on my cheeks, my forehead. Ginseng has been a very popular ingredient in this year and you and you guys are gonna see it more on a lot of products, beauty products. And ginseng is so good for your skin is anti-aging, it's a root, so good for anti-aging, and snail mucin is good for healing. And my moisturizer, I use the Made Sara Cream, and it's from the brand Skin RX Lab. This one has ceramides. Niacinamide and adenosine, these ingredients are so good for brightening, also to help repair your skin barrier. So if you have any irritation, also it will help that alleviate it too. So, perfect. Got that. And because my skin was very dry today, I want to seal all these layers that I just add on and I'm gonna do my sleeping mask. So this one is from Innisfree and is a hydrating sleeping mask and it has green tea. So I'm gonna use this a little bit and it smells so good. So I'm just gonna tap it all over my face. And I'm also gonna use my sleeping mask but on my lips and I have the Laneige one right here. And it's so cute because it comes with a little spatula. So I'm gonna, oh my god, yes, I needed this because my lips were pretty chapped. It will hydrate my lip while I'm sleeping. And I'll wake up with softer lips. And I am good. Oof, that was so good. Now my skin is prepared to go to sleep. So this was my nighttime routine. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to follow me on my social medias at Lorraine. See you on my next video. Annyeong!